Tama na ka, ikaw video ka ng video kung ano ano nasasabi ko eh. Hi guys! We're gonna be firing different sizes na mga Glocks. Alam naman natin, Glock is originated way long time ago, 1982. Ang storya niyan, 1982, naglabas ng procurement request ang Austria. Yung Glock, they decided to make their own para sa ano, nakipaglaban sila sa Beretta, Sig Sauer, HK, and they were the ones who won that tender. Kaya nagsimula yung mga Glocks. The first Glock unit that came out was Glock P80. Pero, pinalitan nila yung name, ginawa nilang Glock 17, considering 17 rounder kasi siya. Pinagyayabang nila yon dati kasi dati konti lang ang laman ng mga 9mm dati 15 rounder lang. Glock was the one that first came out with a 17 rounder magazine para sa mga units niya. Glock 17 was born. Yun yung story nun. So now, I'm gonna be shooting conventional shooting which is two hands, strong hand and weak hand. Titignan ko all sizes. Titignan natin yung actual result ng firing ko. Hindi ko naman sinasabing magaling mo pumutok pero susubukan ko tamaan ng ayos yung aking target board. Pero I will do it as fast as I can. Just to see if I will be accurate with a Glock 17, more accurate with a Glock 19, or more accurate with a Glock 27, or G43. Pero lahat naman sila Glock, they're all good guns. Let's find out how good they are. Let's discuss yung mga sizes ng Glocks. For those who doesn't know, so Glock 17 is the service size. This is the compact size, which is the Glock 19. And this is the subcompact size, which is the Glock 27 or Glock 26 kung 9mm. Pero ngayon, For this demo, we will be using the Glock 27, and we have a Glock 43X, which is pocket pistol. We will be using Armscore bullets, of course. Armscore. Kita niyo naman, promote na promote ko kayo ha. Dahil, Armscore ang ammunition na ginagamit natin dito sa store. We distribute am Armscore as well. And, of course, nandito tayo sa lock and load range. I invite you to come visit us. Mag-firing kayo rito. Enjoy the facilities. And hopefully, may matutunan kayo kahit pa paano. Firing na tayo. Range officer, present, para lang make sure everything is safe. Say hi, Adrian. Hi. Alright. <laughs> okay, so ngayon, conventional shooting muna ako. Two hands. Okay. Load and make ready. Okay, load and make ready. Position one. Condition one, gun on table. Gun on table. Shooter, are you ready? <laughs> ready. Stop by. Let me finish. Nando di show. Clear the clear number down. Host. Clear house. Table. <laughs> As you see, two alpha, two alpha, and alpha Charlie. Pero that's my fault. Matagal na ako hindi nagpa-firing, so hindi ganun ka-accurate yung shot ko. Pero oh, pwede na rin. Ngayon, subukan naman natin, strong hand. Strong hand is much more challenging kasi one hand lang ang shooting ko. And I will be using full metal ammo. Okay, next. Load it back, ready. Shooter, are you ready? <sighs> ready. Stop, bye. Time is 4.88. Yung kanina ba? 2.61. 2.61. So, napatunayan natin, faster talaga shooting conventional kesa doon sa one-handed shooting. Ang patama natin, dito, Alpha Charlie, Alpha Charlie, and 2 Alpha. Not bad. Next, weak hand shooting. Loaded make, ready. Shooter, are you ready? <sighs> ready. Bye-bye. Ando rin, show clear. Okay, clear. Turn down. 5, 7, 9. Oh, mas lalong bumagal. Kasi kaliwete. Tsaka mas mapalag na yung barrel. Hindi ko na masyadong kontrolado. So, Alpha Charlie. 2 Charlie dun sa malayo. And 2 Charlie. So, ang distance nga pala natin, I'm shooting at 5 meters and 7 meters yung medyo malayo natin target. Next, we will be using the Glock 19. Tingnan natin kung mas accurate ba ako sa Glock 19 or Glock 17. Load effect, ready. Shoot around, are you ready? <sighs> ready. Bye-bye! Finish and loading show clear. Okay, clear. So, ang time natin was 2.89. 2 alpha, 2 alpha, 2 alpha. Alright, let's do strong hand shooting naman. Again, with a Glock 19. Medyo madaya kasi I was carrying Glock 19 since 2013. Tapos naging range firearm na siya. Pinarenta na namin para makabili ulit ako ng ibang Glock. All right, next. Strong hand, man. Strong hand. Load it back, ready. Shooter, are you ready? <sighs> ready. Bye bye. Finish. Unload. Show clear. Clear. 
countdown. Time for five to. Ang hits natin, Alpha, Charlie, Alpha, Delta. Mayroon akong Alpha, Delta. And two Alpha. Delta is a bad result. Siguro, nag-flint siya ko or ano. There are things sometimes na nangyayari talaga every time you're shooting kasi you can't always get a good shot. Kaya nga, importante, when you're shooting, you make sure na you see the front sight and rear sight of your sight properly para makapagkalabit ka ng tama. So, yan ang result. Nagkaroon tayo ng Delta. Nobody's perfect. <laughs> Next is weak hand. Ready, Mike? Ready? Get the right ready. <laughs> ready. Start by. Fish, unload, then show here. Here, number down. Time, 5.83. To Alpha, Alpha Charlie, Alpha Charlie then. Katanggap-tanggap pa rin naman. You just follow the discipline of uh, making sure that you still see your target bago nyo kalabitin yung trigger nyo. Next is the subcompact, which is the Glock 27. This is a 40 caliber, so I expect na mas malakas siya and will be able to get more recoil. So, mas mabagal din ang response ko dapat. So, tingnan natin. Kuha tayo ng 40 caliber na bala kasi 9mm lang yun na rito. We have the 40 caliber ammo. 40 caliber is supposedly a stronger caliber than the 9mm. Hopefully, kayo mga nanonood, makatulong din para sa pamimili nyo ng barrel. Let's say you're deciding between the sizes kung ano yung maganda for you guys. Si Glock 27 is a subcompact pistol, so iniisip natin masyado maliit para sa kamay natin. Pero ang ating magazine is extended, so may tatamaan tayo ng daliri when you're holding the gun. So, hindi bitin sa kamay nyo. Load and back, ready! Six shots, conventional. Chamber loaded. Chamber loaded nga pala. Shooter, are you ready? <sighs> ready. Sabay! If you are finished, unload. Let me show clear. Be clear. Hammer down. Time, 2.46. Hindi masyado na iba yung time natin sa conventional shooting. Ang hits natin, 2 Alpha, Alpha Charlie, and 2 Alpha. Next, we will do the strong hand shooting. Medyo worried ako kasi I'll be using one hand. And ramdam ko na mas mapalag siya ng konti. Pero I think we're still doing a pretty good job when it comes to accuracy since we're still hitting Alpha and Charlies. Mostly Alphas, which is good. Loading back, ready. Shooter, are you ready? <sighs> ready. Start by... Finish and loading show clear. Right there, power down. Awesome. 578. 578, bumagal na. Kasi naramdaman ko na na medyo mapalag talaga siya sa strong hand. At ang patama ko ngayon, Alpha Charlie, nag Charlie Delta ako doon sa malayo. So, again, shooter error. I didn't follow through with my discipline of waiting for my sight. Also, yung pagkalabit ko, medyo makalog na siya. And pagdating ko sa malapit, Alpha Charlie ang hits. So, Next, ito na, mas nakakatakot. Left hand shooting or weak hand shooting. Hopefully, tumama sila lahat <laughs> sa board. Load it back, ready. Show the right, you're ready. <laughs> ready. Start by. If you are finished, and load and show clear. If clear, now down. Yan ang table. Time, 4.73. Ha! Mas bumilis. Mas bumilis. <laughs> Hindi ko alam kung bakit siya mas bumilis. Pero 4.73 daw yung tao. Ang hits, Alpha, Alpha, Charlie, Charlie. So, Alpha Delta yung last. Tumatama pa rin naman sa ano, even with my weak hand. I, I don't know why, what happened, bakit siya mas mabilis. Pero tanggapin na lang natin na mas mabilis siya ng konti. Siguro, through my transitions, mas naging komportable ako sa kanya. That's why nagpakawala ako. Kaso, yun nga, nag-suffer naman yung accuracy ko. You saw that my last shot was a Delta shot. Next! Ito na, Glock 43X naman na itatry natin. Para sa akin, personally, yung Glock 43X is ano, very handy. Tsaka mas sarap gamitin, mas sarap dalhin. It's my carry gun. So, tingnan natin if I'm gonna be accurate with my own carry gun. Load and make ready. Kitha, are you ready? Ready. Stand by. If you're finished, hello, this show clear time. 1.87 1.87 So, faster yung time ko Ang hits is Alpha, Charlie 2 Alpha, Alpha, Charlie Not bad Katanggap-tanggap naman As I said, ito yung bago kong carry gun I've been carrying the Glock 43X I haven't been practicing with the gun So, hindi pa ganun ka ano Pero masarap siya iputok Fit siya sa kamay ko Kaya, I, I love it Now, we'll do uh, strong hand shooting With the Glock 43X Tingnan natin kung anong Magiging time natin Load and make ready Shutter are you ready? <sighs> ready. Bye bye. 
If you are finished unloading, show clear. Clear. Time. 3.79 Time is 3.79 Hits Alpha Charlie 2 Charlie Alpha Charlie Ay, hindi 2 Alpha pala to Wait Ay, hindi Alpha Charlie nga <laughs> Next We can We can We can na Loading back ready Shooter, are you ready? <sighs> ready Stand by If you're finished Unloading show clear Clear? Hammer down? Time! 6.04 Oh, okay. 6.04 Dahil hindi nga masyadong sanay Sa kaliwa, ayun, ramdam natin na Nagtagal ako bago ma-acquire kayo yung target ko His is Alpha Charlie Alpha Charlie And... Diba? 2 Alpha Kahit pa paano naka 2 Alpha tayo Overall, para sa akin Pinakakomportable kong naputok was the Glock 19 Kasi matagal ko nga siyang carry Next would be the Glock 17 uh, Accurate ako Sa Glock 43X Mas mabilis ako sa kanya kasi nga Mas nasanay ako Pero yung hits ko hindi ganun kaganda It's probably because masyado siya malit sa kamay ko I don't know Pero maganda pa rin naman yung hits Hindi kasing ganda the way it was with the Glock 19 and Glock 17 40 caliber naman Ramdam ko talaga na mas malakas siya compared sa 9mm Yung palag niya Kaya mas matagal ko bago ma-acquire yung target Ngayon Ito lang naman yan eh When you're picking your gun Make sure na you grab it, you hold on to it, ramdam nyo dapat yung proper grip with the pistol. Dapat hindi yung parang hindi ka komportable when you pick your gun. Kasi if that's something that you still have to worry about when you're grabbing your gun, pag kinailangan mo, hindi ko sasuggest sa yung baril na yun. Dapat yung as comfortable as you are. Para hindi mo na siya isipin, puputok ka na lang in times of need. Yun ang ibig sabihin ko. Also, pag mas maganda yung grip mo sa baril mo, mas maganda ang results ng patama mo. Last, dapat yung accuracy mo would always be there. How do you do that? Always make sure that you align your sights. Front sight, rear sight, align with your target. By the way, forgot to thank my sponsor, 24K Radiance. Yan, yan ang aking bagong skincare regimen. Although hindi halata sa mukha ko, alamin natin after 2 weeks sa next video. Tingnan natin kung kikinis sa mukha ko. Also, lock and load sportswear. Lagi niyong isusot.